there would be tremendously large fountains of gas water coming out that would probably create tsunami waves. Born out of the violence of the eruption and traveling at speeds of up to 500 miles per hour, 50-foot-high waves would swamp coastal areas across the Gulf. The tsunamis would spread out from the epicenter of the eruption, devastating huge population centers from Houston to New Orleans and across the west coast of Florida. The entire Gulf could be battered by monster waves, which surge more than six miles inland, much larger and more destructive than the South Asian and Japanese tsunamis. But the impact from the ocean would only be the beginning. Methane-rich clouds billow up from the sea and begin to spread 400 miles across the Gulf. 